Hey everybody, it's Chris from Tipton and Hearst, and we're back for more happies. Today's Monday, so I thought it would be fun to kind of show how to take gladiolas, which are on sale at Tipton and Hearst for $12.95 a bunch of 10 stems, and make four different arrangements. Pretty quick, pretty simple, pretty easy. And I just remembered I forgot my tea leaf. Oh well, we're gonna roll we're with the rolling pun, with, with it. the punches. So First off, this is what gladiolas look like for those that don't know. These are all, they're 10 stems, $12.95 a bunch. I'm gonna get that out of the way. Put it right here for right now. So let's start out with something kind of simple. Simple vase, glass cylinder vase. And we're gonna take our leaf and we're gonna curve it there. And we're going to take another one and we're going to curve it right in there. Now the reason why I put it to the very edge is by the time I finish doing the insertions of the gladiolas, it's probably going to sink all the way to the bottom. So on this arrangement, we're going to use some Aurelia or Fatsy leaves. We're going to use one stem, a really big stem of Pussy Willow. And I'm going to cut all these off the main stem, off the main branch. And I'm going to use one bunch of glads. So, how is everybody out in happy land? Happy. I've only got two more hours. I'm out of jail. Woohoo! Look at you. You'll probably go back though. And I don't know how many times this past weekend I've tried to respond to somebody like happy birthday or something or that looks great and nothing. Nothing. I forget. Totally well, forget. on Saturday, I went back and posted the picture, and I went and liked some friends, com some family oh, members' comments. Stars! Can you believe how many people like like the like twelve hundred like, likes? Super I late at night, I thought all these poor people are waiting. <laughs> but I wanted to wait so that you know, if people, you know, just so the people at the party got to see it first. So uh -huh. we don't like to show our customer stuff before then. Right. Okay, so to our happy family, yeah. we have Miss Joanne from Wisconsin, Nalinda from Puerto Rico, friends from Houston, South Carolina, West Virginia, Maryland, Conway, McCroy, Canada, Maryland, Bella Vista, Minneapolis, Indonesia, oh, wow. Philadelphia, Louisiana, Kentucky, Mississippi. Oh man, all over. So on this one, if you notice, I'm trying to turn all the glads out like this. Just like that. So there's no stem, so all your blooms, actually almost like an outside collar or like a stack. So someone asked, how's your arm today? It's good, finally. Hmm. I got through the class. Yeah, we had our workout I class I did, yesterday. I didn't, have to, I didn't have to like use it for a crutch or use it as a, oh, I can't do that because of my arm. It was all right. Oh, Ooh. did you see, I don't bet you haven't noticed, but did you see that that, we were talking about the other day, people were asking about the people were like in, was it Wisconsin or Idaho, Idaho, I believe. Oh my gosh, they had like a hurricane. <gasps> I didn't know that. My There's a special name Idaho. for it, like a, I forgot what the name is, but they had like 110 mile winds. That's why oh I don't have any goodness. power. I had no idea until yesterday I was watching the news. I finally got to sit down and watch the news. So it we was, have lots of friends watching today. Someone asked, how's the experiment with the rose guard petals? Well, y'all, it is still at my desk. I can't really tell the difference. Can I you? can't really tell the difference either. Tomorrow, we'll show y'all, but you know yeah. how it looks. We'll bring I'll, it back I'll keep down. Keep looking at it. I can't, like, I can't tell the difference. Let me move this over here so I'll knock you off your chair. Oh, gosh. <laughs> it's kind of like getting real close. Okay, so y'all, we've got to bob tell y'all. Bob and weave, bob and weave. That's true. Okay, do you want to tell them about the someone maybe trying to be me on Facebook? Yeah, well, you're the one experiencing it. Okay, but so we had one of our happy family members did. text us, or did she call you? Or she text called you? me. She called me and said, "There's someone making comments, instant messaging. He's using, he's using, he's using like a, a portfolio. His name's a, yeah. Barry K. Durant. But, but then, but he's messaging the, like the he's the message me. is coming from you." Yeah, like at the end, he says, Christina Day, Tipton Hurst. Yeah. So, if y'all get that, open let, us know, not, let us know because I've because reported we've, it. And yeah, we've called Facebook. But maybe they'll put him in jail. Yes, hopefully so. <laughs> but, anyways, it is not me if you're getting those messages. Yeah. One of our, from day one, one of our followers, right. happy family members, got in. I don't want y'all to be getting that. So, just let yeah. us know. So, well, we have friends from. 
Um, New York, Vegas, Seattle, Sligo, Alabama, Iowa, Florida. Awesome. Woo, all over. Awesome, awesome. So I'm going to throw that away. Look, so my mother one. just said what because I hadn't told her today. Uh, well, yeah. Janae Oops. will be calling. Yeah, Janae will be checking that man down. So I want to quickly show you why we have an opportunity without making yes. space. So this we just did for Oopsie. the pre-tape for Channel 7 for tomorrow. And what I've done is I went back and done a block of foam this way. And then I took just one bunch of glads and I cut all the floorlets off like we had a couple weeks ago. Like that. And we put all the floorlets in there. Then we went back and added just a little bit of greenery. So these are the tips as I was cutting those. I'll actually show those in a second how we do that again. So these are just the tips and these are the floorlets that are still left on the main stem inserted to make a low centerpiece of just one bunch of glads. And we added just a little bit of citrus, orange, A for aroma, and just a little pop of different color in there. So while I'm thinking about that, I'm gonna go ahead and move. Oops. So someone said, Miss Donna asked Chris if the greener is called Fatsia too. Fatsia, yes. Yes. So, um, we have someone that said, why do you not take the tips off of your uh, glides? I like it because it adds a little bit more drama to the top and makes it look a little bit more whimsical or less stiff. But that's to each his own. You can easily leave them on, take them off. So, anyway. Perfect. Perfect. So the next one we're going to do is I'm actually going to work with one bunch of glides first in this one little vase from UCI. So Miss Linda said, can you post Facebook's phone number? I don't have it. I, from our happy family member, she told me the name that it came from and I went on him and then reported it and then sent, sent a note that way. So yeah. if y'all look at Barry K. Durant and report him because that's not me. Yeah. I love these color glides. So on this one, we're actually going to use negative space. Miss <laughs> Nancy said, you just let us know. We'll get them for you. No place for that sort of well, nonsense. It's, it's not so much about you. It's just we were worried about our happy memory. We were because I don't want y'all to be getting yeah, messaged. Because our viewer, I don't want to say her name, but she said, I thought, oh my goodness, Christina messaged me. And then she went on there and she was like, it was not you. It was just signs like it was me at the bottom. Yeah, so. and I came real close to messaging. Well, I can't right now. But we had a happy member post the other day about how lonely she was. And I thought, I ought to go in there and just say something to her. Well, probably can't do that now, can I? No. Because she's going to think I'm some wacky doodle. But anyway. Well, but if it comes from your name, though, you know, mine didn't come as my name. Oh, did it? It was coming as oh, the Barry right. Durant guy. So I still could. Yeah, yeah. you could. This, yeah. Kind of hurt my heart the other day when she said that she that was is sad. herself. That is sad. Anyway, so let's go back and take just a few leaves here and see how I'm using the void space with this. So you're getting like a framing effect. Stay in there. So Miss Betsy said someone once told her not to put cut fruit in an arrangement because it dries bugs and flies to it. Well, so does rotting flowers. <laughs> That's true too. <laughs> we do a lot of fruit, especially in the holiday time with um, fruit in them. So the main thing is you don't want, I would just open this up, this part up for the day of the party. A, it gives the beautiful aroma of orange and also adds more texture. But if you just had the centerpiece in your home, you probably wouldn't want to leave the, I would even try, I would try to make it where I could just lay the oranges into the arrangement and not have them on picks. Cause when you put a pick in it, then it pokes a hole in it. But someone said you actually can take wax, dip the pick in wax. Oh. Or and also there's something else, some kind of, is it alum you can dip them into? To Maybe help? so. Or Anastasia something. said, doesn't Barry have something else to do, like get a job? Someone said, what uh, is the cost of the glads? The glads are twelve ninety five a bunch. And Miss Kathy said, you make having shingles bearable. Mm, oh. We hope you get better well, soon. Well, mercy, I hope you get well soon. That's not something to play around with. I will tell you, I was real, we went and picked up our daughter's my grand dog yesterday first time i've gotten to see my grandkids 
we still social distance as best we could. Um, but she lives in Fayetteville. We had to stop in Ozark. None of those people in that store were wearing a mask. About Only about 25%. It freaked me out. I could not get out of there fast enough. So, people in Ozark, y'all need to be wearing a mask. <laughs> we got the Nazi <laughs> right in front of us, y'all. <laughs> Let me tell you, I do not like it. He does not. <laughs> so. It was funny when we got to our workout class, he was like, does everybody have their own square? And it's like a very large square. And I'm like, yes, we all well, have a it square. It was out in the field. It was out in the field. Yeah. But it, it really was social distance. It was yeah, good. Yeah, it was great. So you can I'm just do the glass like this. But now I'm going to go back and add just a few tropical flowers into it. So someone asked, is this vase mirrored? Oh, uh, I guess it, it is. Looks like well, it. it's not really mirror, mirror. It's just the chrome part of it. Did I drop that? I never picked it up. I didn't throw him up. It's on the ground. Oops. So. This is all you're going to get today on that one. There we go. There you go. So close it when the close. dip ends. Clove, that's pigment. right. Yeah. Clove, is it, isn't it clove oil or is it clove like Ms. crushed Jill clove? Ms. Jill said clove. Like Ms. Kathy said how many are in a bunch of glads? Ten, ten stems. Ten stems in a bunch. Oh, Miss Donna responded that. So great. Okay. So there's that one. I actually added up. There's an accident in theorem right there on the ground. <laughs> Where? Oh, there it is. Yep. <laughs> but you just can't see it. So there's that one. So I would actually want to show you how you could just do linear line, but then I went back and accent with just a few tropical flowers, so something a little bit more bright and colorful. Miss Judith just tuned on. She's from Michigan, and she's so excited that she caught you. Oh, good. So are the orange flowers birds of paradise? They're hel parrot beak heliconia. Same variety, same family ish. But they're just a smaller one. They don't have that beautiful blue tongue and the part that pops out. Miss Cheryl said she grew those in New Jersey. Really? Wow, that's awesome. So on this one, I'm actually going to take this really fun container. And it is a mere $35. So Miss Linda said that she got a like from Christina Day on her comment yesterday at 630. That was me. I, since Mr. Chris was not on the Facebook, that was me. That okay. was not the hacker, that was me. Now this guy sent a direct message. He sent a direct message, yeah. And then put you and in then put the me, message. Yeah. He like, at the end, instead of signing at Barry, he signed at Christina Day, Tipton Hurst. Mm. Mm, so fun. Don't Does the first it. cut decide the overall height and size of the arrangement? A lot of times, yes. So let me go through here and I wanna try something. Miss yeah. Barbara said, in theoriums were her mother's favorite. We had arrangements for her casket using those. Well, that's my mother-in-law's favorite, too. And she's always said, I only want in theoriums. You better not give me red carnations. Angela, you may be getting red carnations. <laughs> oh, no, just teasing. She's always said she loves blue iris and red in theorium. So. We have a lot of people that like this container. You want to tell us the details on it? Uh, it's a ceramic. It's a matte finish. It looks like swirled. It looks like a melted vanilla and chocolate shake that's been swirled up. It does. That's for sure. sure. What's the price? Thirty. Don't tell you. Oh, I, I don't know. You. Did you? Thirty-five. Okay, there we go. Thirty-five dollars. So, oops, drop that one. So, now I'm going to go back and actually take these, and I'm going to make a focal point. Miss Cindy asked if we sell faux greenery on the website. She couldn't find any. Uh, we no, should. No, not on our website. We don't have silks on our website. Yet. Yeah, not yet. But we can definitely help you with yeah, that. Yeah, definitely can help you with so that. So, Miss Sheila just tuned on, and she asked, how is your arm today? It's good. It's real good. Everyone said you just do such beautiful arrangements. Well, thank you. Let me skip around and get this one. Oops. Wish I'd be able to get that anthurium over there, but that ain't happening. No, we'll have another hot mess Saturday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jeez, y'all. <laughs> that wasn't Saturday. That was Friday, wasn't it? Was it? I thought it was Saturday. Maybe it was Friday. <laughs> all the hot messes. All the hot messes go together. Huh? Yeah, they really do. No, it was that. No, it was Friday it because was Friday. Saturday we did the party. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh man, hot yeah. mess, y'all. Yeah. So, what did y'all think about those that got to see the party? What did you think about it? The end. Yeah, what did y'all think about the party arrangement that we posted? 
Miss Pat said she got a message from him too. Oh. She said it. It. My message was like he wanted to hook up. Oh gosh. Now I'm really paranoid, y'all. It's not me. If oh gosh. But did it say Christina Day at the end of it? I don't know. Someone asked how he knew my name, and that's a great question too. Other than that, I've mess- liked y'all's messages. Well, that or he must watch the show. So, let's just move on because that freaks me out. Miss Melody said that she received her gift card today. She's so excited. Awesome. Miss Tammy said, how long will it last in the Oasis? Um, as long oh, wait, as you no, keep it. I'm sorry. She said, how long is it best to soak Oasis? Oh, to soak. Let me show you where I am right now. So, that's where we're going. Pretty. So, um, Oasis is a trick to it and it's really a simple trick. So, you want to fill like your sink or you fill your tub or fill a big bucket up. And all you want to do is take the dry foam and just set it right on top. Don't ever, ever push it down. For some reason, when you push it down or hold it down, it's only going to soak in like halfway in and it's going to leave an air pocket in the middle. Never have understood why, never understood. It just makes no sense, really. So really, you just want to lay it on top of the water and it honestly will soak in about 45 seconds, totally, usually. So that's the trick to that. So... So, of course, everyone's saying they loved the party arrangement. They thought it was beautiful. The tall arrangement was gorgeous. Oh, good. They loved the party arrangement. Oh, look who tuned on. Leanne Jolly. She said Bert 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 Jolly. Are we seriously watching this at the same time? Oh, my gosh. Well, we love y'all. I'm really sore from yesterday, but hey guys, can't wait to do it it again. It was so much fun. I kind of wanted to turn the other way, though, because the wind was blowing that way. It was. <laughs> At one point, there. as Chris leaned over, and he's like, if you turn the opposite way, the wind is really blowing. <laughs> but we got so lucky, though, because the sun wasn't really yeah, out. Yeah, it was so great. The sun was like, it was just, it was perfect almost, actually. If you need a workout, just, yeah, I think it's like jollybodies.com, jolly, jolly but bodies. it's fabulous. So someone asked, did we get a new Lazy Susan? We did. Mama Norwood got me a, a $16 Lazy Susan, and it seems to be doing the trick. So it is perfect. Let me spin it back around this way and see where we're going. So let's take this line now. Miss Bonnie said that we make the happy happier. Oh, okay. Leanne said, hi. Hey, girl. Hey. And she played lots of Britney Spears, which reminds me of my child growing up. So. <laughs> Made me real happy. Miss uh, Beth said, "Yay, I made another live." Yeah, cool. Miss Martha said, "Hi from the woodlands." Lots of people saying they love the arrangements. Miss Sharon said that she has a funeral arrangement to do for Wednesday, and she's going to try this. Oh, good. Everyone said they love, love, love the arrangement. Oh, good. So let's counteract the. So we've had a few people ask, "How do you make Glad's open faster?" Well, supposedly, of course, you can always put them in warm water. It's going to help flush the water up supposedly faster. Old wives' tale, though, is that if you pop the top, the tip out, for some reason that pulls it pulls it up faster and makes them bloom faster. Um, I've done that a couple of times. I don't know that it would have made... I didn't really test it in the fact that Oh, I'm going to add some sticks to this just for you, by the way. Okay, thank you. Because I knew that you Miss Joanna said, Mama Norwood, will we get to meet Mama Norwood? You might. She might be here Friday. I don't know. I'm trying to talk her into helping me do my... Because you're going to be gone. I'm going to be gone. gone. Yeah. Are you going to do it on Saturday? I, we might. I don't know. I see. won't be here Friday and Saturday, I, I so... And Monday, too, right? Well, I'll well, probably be back on Monday. Okay. I'll probably be back on Sunday now, yeah. but we'll just see. Okay. Friday and Saturday, though, I won't. Okay. Anyway, I haven't really discussed it with her yet, but... You well, know, she's probably listening yeah, right now, yeah. so... I don't know. She's been kind of busy, so... Oh, no. Anyway. Well, people said that they did like the sticks in the last arrangement, and I agree with them. I like the sticks in that, too. <laughs> Probably not so much on this one. Oh, Miss Martha just said, hooray in the sticks. You've got some stick haters out there, though. You do. Someone yeah. wanted to make a group for the stick yeah, haters. <laughs> <laughs> we need a meeting. 
Yep, we do. Okay. You can lead the stick groupies, and I'll lead the non-stick groupies. Okay, that's okay. So we're almost done here. Yeah, Miss Joanne said, we need to meet the ladies who keep our happy family rolling along. Yeah. So there's that one. Yeah, tell Miss Norwood we want her to come here. Yeah. Well, we <laughs> will relay the message. Yeah, yeah. She's, because uh, she always goes back and tells me what comments I've missed. Well, you but know, you sometimes respond? I think that I don't see I all the honestly comments. Honestly, don't either. Because someone just responded to someone else, and I didn't see that person. So yeah, I don't and know. a lot of times that happens with us as far as it goes so fast. I think there is. And then, like, I'll try to, in the past, I've tried to respond, and it kind of cuts me off. Like, it says, keep scrolling, and there's nothing to scroll down to. And I know they're there because there's, like, 1,200 comments, and I've only answered, Looked like, at 600. Some. So, anyway... So I thought it'd be fun just to take some simple glads today and show you four different tricks. Well, not tricks, but just four different simple drop-ins using void space, using very few glads, and making a focal point with one at the base, making almost like a floorlet or a gamelia at the base. And then how to use those same things. Oh, techniques. well, we can't see that one. Can you move this around? Yes, ma'am. Oh, perfect. Yeah, we can. Then making a collar of glads and using some kind of your stick to make a frame around it or like a trellis around it and then using your glad blooms at the base so simple easy very inexpensive and so there we go so i hope y'all enjoy today's happy um i'll get out of jail in two more hours cannot wait so anyway we will see you tomorrow thanks for joining us and we're going to start fall tomorrow yay i'm ready for fall i saw mums or i think it was mom plants upstairs and i thought oh fall i'm we're so excited do those velvet pumpkins I think. yeah anyway we'll see you tomorrow thanks y'all have a safe night and have a blessed evening and hope everybody's doing good talk to you later see ya bye